Hi everyone and welcome to White Skies Wisdom. This is a tarot card reading for the star song of Libra for February. And I'd just like to say sorry Libra for not putting out any in January. We had some pretty severe, pretty severe fires here in Australia uh, and we're all on pretty much high alert. I'm fine, not affected, but I was living out in the bush and so I decided to take a little while off just to deal with that and enjoy the rest of this summer. So yeah, all right, we'll get straight into it. So Libra, here you are in all your glory, the king of swords standing in your power or sitting in your power, knowing your mind, knowing your worth. You are very feeling very strong, very powerful. Uh, you could be feeling seeming a little bit cold to other individuals though that try and approach you. Okay, so that might be something coming up for you this month. But we'll just get straight into it here for you, Libra, and see what's going on. <laughs> Sticky cards. All right, Libra, February 2020. Advice for Libra, please. Libra. Radio. Okay, so you could be starting off this month taking some time out for yourself, realizing you need to nurture your heart uh, and your body here to be able to bring stability into your life. If you're finding that you are feeling a little bit off kilter, those the scales aren't in balance, uh, time alone in nature will really help you at this time as well. But it looks like you are really wanting stability in your emotions so something might have happened here that could have you feeling a little bit off kilter but we'll just get some clarification the page of cups yes you could be dealing with uh, two other individuals here and or you might be finding that someone's giving um, emotion to somebody else and or you're keeping your emotions to yourself okay with the king of uh, swords at the top there it could be very much you keeping your emotions to yourself about how you feel about a situation because you haven't got stability and know exactly your mind and until you know exactly what how you feel you won't be able to really start to mentally deal with that. So it looks like you're taking time out at the beginning of the month here, keeping your emotions to yourself, going about looking after yourself uh, and um, start just enjoying yourself, wanting to enjoy yourself as, as much as you can. Okay, It comes from and could seem like having other people have been very defensive with you and or you are being very defensive with them okay you're you've come to a point where this is who I am this is what I'm doing this is what I want to do and that's that okay so you could be putting up a bit of a wall around yourself uh, and or other people could be reacting quite um, defensively to that stance that you might be coming from here okay it could come off the back of feeling like someone stole away with your heart, stole away with their friendship, stole away with maybe even some of your own possessions here. Uh, you could be feeling like wanting to just up and leave a situation as well. Okay. You've decided, right, that's it. This is the way it is. I'm, I'm out of here. Okay. But because you may not be telling people exactly how you feel, it might seem to others that you're just taking, just leaving and not engaging in the fight here okay and all this is someone doing it to you but it looks like you're leaving the loyalty of others behind so there's people here wanting to love and support you but you're deciding to go out on your own okay and it looks like you've come to a very strong decision as to why you are doing this okay and I think it's to balance yourself out okay to balance yourself out to balance your life out to have everything in your life ordered and balanced and and known okay these are the rules of my life and that's that it's the way it's going to roll and or you're, you're falling back to uh, your innate ability to be able to uh, bring 
balance and justice to a situation by doing it to yourself first. Okay, just be careful that you aren't a, the judge, jury and executioner in your own life in so far as you don't judge yourself too harshly and or judge others too harshly for their actions. Okay, uh, even though your decision might be final, okay, in your mind here, it's uh, other people might be affected by this. So anyway, it seems like you have come to a decision, you are balancing out your life and you're going to do it at all costs. It's going to, you. whenever you're feeling unbalanced is when um, your life can seem literally out of control. So you might have come out of a period where you felt like your life has been out of control and so that's why you're falling back to your natural innate ability to be able to bring balance back to yourself. By bringing balance back to yourself, you can bring balance back to the exterior as well, or they then be able to be um, the confidant, the guide, the um, inspiration, the person of authority that you naturally are uh, and be able to help others. Okay. So yes, um, charities, best at home or something like that. I can't remember that saying or anything too, but make sure you're caring for yourself and balancing out. Don't be doing anything in excess at the moment, drinking, smoking, eating too much, whatever it be. Could be working too hard or exercising too hard. Could be anything. Okay. Make sure you bring balance into your life to bring the stability and the structure that you need. Okay. Yeah. And you're feeling very inspired to make sure this happens to make sure that you actually start to bring stability. When you start to bring stability in is when you'll be able to start to, to hook into and acknowledge, notice that sort of thing, your own emotions, okay? And so I think by doing this, it's actually going to be uh, very beneficial, not just to yourself, but to your relationships in your life here, okay? And also you, by doing that, you're going to feel inspiration and spark for your life again, inspiration and spark to, uh, work on relationships or your, your work or something like that. But yeah, the universe wants you to be balanced first and grounded too. So getting out in nature, as I said earlier, is going to be really important. And second ace, so brand new passionate start, brand new inspiration, okay? Brand new thoughts, brand new mental way of dealing with things, brand, brand, brand new way of thinking about things has come about. Okay. So yes, it looks like very much that your, your inspirations and your mind are starting to really start to say, right, new start, things need to, to be balanced again. I'm going to look after number one for a little while. Uh, and by doing that, you can have a brand new start in your life. Now this could be literally you're choosing just to have a brand new break, right? Brand new start and or a brand new start when it comes to existing relationships. Okay. But we'll get some more clarification. Yeah. So the defensiveness has come from past issues, past broken hearts could have been broken three times here and you're willing to possibly sacrifice a couple of good relationships here to, to bring a brand new start because of your defensiveness. Be careful of that. Um, you, you still need love and support in your life here. You still need to acknowledge your emotions, still need to deal with issues of the past, you can't just walk away and that sort of thing or someone's done this to you. Okay. And it looks like if that's the case, if someone's done this to you and has got very defensive, you're willing to sacrifice the relationship at this time. Um, but yeah, it's, it's really important to go within at this time and just see the source of this um, defensiveness to actually acknowledge that maybe you are feeling a little bit more defensive than you possibly need to be. Uh, and on the opposite side of the coin, if you've been far too lax with people, it might be time to put up some sort of defenses in so far as, well, this is where I stand and this is the way it is. Okay. Yes. And the, the, your, the choice you're making, if you're making the choice just to drop everything and go is coming from feeling complete and utter confusion. You've been stuck. You haven't been able to figure out what to do. Your emotions have been everywhere. You're, your mind's been everywhere. It could have had something to do with the Taurus here with the bull in the background. But you felt like you've been blindfolded, you've been tied, you've been bound, you've been stuck. Okay. So it's now time to bring balance 
to that situation by standing in your truth and knowing who you are knowing your emotions getting more stability in your life here realizing there is people here to support you and love you to put down those defenses but by first bringing balance into your own life by choosing to balance out the scales okay make sure you don't end up judging people too negatively just by cutting everything off okay getting out your sword and just going whack that's it right it's i'm i'm the master um, and or if other people are doing that to you it's time to realize that you aren't stuck as you actually think you are it looks like the taurus here could have your back okay and maybe you felt threatened by this okay you might be felt threatened by this taurus or this loyalty okay a dog dog energy a loyal energy or a a Taurus or an earth sign okay but they've got you back they're trying to protect you while you're going through this real heartache if that's your case here um, yeah uh, still even so even if you did walk okay so that's something to consider as well all right and we'll just get the clarificator on justice here yeah so the justice has come about the wanting to balance the scales here because you're wanting to protect your heart you might have closed up your heart you might have like this lady here with her heart in that beautiful box okay but you've had to go within here it's time to go within to check in with yourself and decide exactly what you do want and it looks like you want balance structure and the ability to move away out of mental confusion into karma waters and it looks like you're going to have the ability to do so yeah, you're definitely going to have the ability to do so but i'd just like to find out I'll just get some clarification yep thank you yeah so it looks like yes you've been able to you will be able to balance yourself out you will be able to move away from troubles of the past it still looks your heart has been hurt wounded you're protecting it okay but it looks like you're going to start to come out to a period here be careful not to drink too much at this time drinking's a bit indicated here with the knight of cups and um, this card here of the page of cups okay and or you're starting to mature you're starting to mature or actually start to recognize your emotions far more and starting to find joy again in your life okay maybe very much getting out there and doing your own thing you might feel inspired and passionate again about your life and or relationships here okay and want to rush in um, all guns blazing you will start to feel once doing this that maybe you know you might need to go back into a quiet period you might be out partying you might be out you know doing whatever you like and then have to go back into a, a time of quietness here but you actually will start to see uh, a shift in your energy here you'll start to see things from a very different perspective once you actually get yourself balanced here uh, it's going to make a big difference in your life definitely you could be attracted to a fire sign as well or and or dealing with a fire sign at the moment uh, but definitely you're starting to feel a lot better about yourself you're starting to really you know dress better and look better and feel better okay more inspired more passionate more grounded okay uh, and that's from gleaming a different perspective taking yourself out of a situation where you're very defensive and thinking about issues of the past to a place where you're starting to sit definitely back up on your throne again okay you're starting to see how other people get themselves into trouble and this has always been an innate uh, ability for yourself to be able to stand back and watch how patterns in life too um, so yeah you're starting to realize how other people can get themselves into trouble and I think you're starting to get a little bit more wisdom about it okay starting to step out of issues uh, other people's issues and um, issues that you might have got yourself into in the past here because you definitely want a brand new financial start and it looks like uh, and a stable start starting from stability and it looks like you're going to be able to get that this month and it's actually going to leave you in a place where you're going to be able to offer your emotions again offer your emotions to yourself offer your emotions to others 
okay from a very grounded standpoint wise standpoint but also you'll end up in a very loving standpoint here okay so yeah it looks like you're starting off the month very defensive and very much in your energy here but I think you're really going to start to go through the process here of hooking into yourself enjoying yourself remembering who you are you might fall back into a defensive stance here or end up being reminded of issues of the past and it may make you want to run literally okay and it could also have you feeling very confused and stuck in your head but you're going to end up bringing balance to this and actually quite rapidly I think you're going to be quite surprised or others will be quite surprised just how much you bring balance back into the situation um, and be able to protect your heart and move out of troubles any troubles that might come up uh, into karma waters here and it's going to be coming from you realizing how other people can get themselves into trouble and deciding to distance yourself from that finding stability and then realizing that we can't be whole people until we acknowledge our emotions and our heart and actually start to come from not just your incredible ability in your mind but also the strength of your heart being a venus led sign so it looks like not just yourself but everybody in your life is going to benefit from this great transformation you're going through at the moment libra so i'd just like to say congratulations this looks like it's going to be a, a really interesting month for you a month where you discover yourself you discover patterns in your life you realize that stability and balance is what is needed and you will end up coming to a place of balance love groundedness you're going to end up to a point where you're going to be able to offer that overflowing cup of love that is yours to others so yeah that's wonderful I'm really pleased all right so I just like to say thank you so much Libra I love you all and bye for now